Where are we? Boat show. That's right, we are at Mid Canada Boat Show, me and the girlfriend. Welcome back to another episode of Pilgrim Outdoors and get ready to check out these babies. Just bought my new Ranger boat. Just kidding, I couldn't afford that if my life depended on it. Can't go wrong with picking up some Zima and plastics, tell you that much. They are stock here. So guys, I ran into one of my bass fishing idols, Jeff Gustafson. He is a bass master. He is one of the best, in my opinion, one of the elites. And I'm happy to finally see you again. Yeah, buddy. Awesome. Making the rounds. At the Making show. the rounds, hoping to run into some awesome celebrities. But um, I was wondering, could you give the fans some tips on spring bass? Spring bass, like talking on Lake of the Woods. Lake of the Woods, Winnipeg River, anywhere yeah. they can get at. Yeah, so I love, as soon as the ice goes out, it's some of the best fish of the year. Fish are grouped up big time still. So um, suspending jerk baits and, uh, and just like, you know, start on the main lake and work your way into the base. Just hitting every little point, drop pile, and you're gonna run into them somewhere. Awesome. So we're saying, uh, obviously, don't go for the cause, don't go for your top water yet, but fish mid column. Yeah. So, as you said, yeah, for and, you know, from six to twenty feet, kind of, and they'll usually be like. For a couple of weeks after the ice goes out, you're gonna find like big packs. So it can be kind of like Easter fam, but if you find a little point or reef where they're at, you can catch like 20 and 20 cows. So you can definitely find them in that deep, deep transition point. Yeah, to they're wanting to come up like shallow. So right, right. if you get like some warm weather, it's gonna get better, better shallower and uh, those bright like sunny days. That's all I'm all good. But. Yeah. So. Tubes, always good to have a tube yeah, tied I mean, on. That's probably like, what I'm gonna hit up for. Tube. Always catches a whip all year round. You heard it from the best, man. Thank you very much for hey, your buddy. time. Appreciate it. All right. Janine, it's a new boat. I love it. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> well, that concludes our visit to Mid Canada Boat Show. What did you think? It was good. Lots of fancy boats, and there's nothing I can afford at the moment, or the looking at least. Catch you guys later. Thanks for tuning in to this episode of Pilgrim Outdoors. Catch you on the next one.